In this video, I'll share the top two template strategies that we see among Proposify customers and how to know if one of them is right for your team. Hi, it's Lauren with the question of the minute. How many proposal templates does my team really need? Well, it's actually less about the total number of templates you have and more about how you set up and use them. In this video, I'll share the top two template strategies that we see among Proposify customers and how to know if one of them is right for your team. Up first is one we call the Frankenstein, which is where you create a principal template with placeholders so sales reps can easily add the content they need. It's good for sales teams that want to simplify the proposal process while maintaining that control over the info that's going into the proposals. It works especially well in industries like digital advertising, where a high level of customization is needed for each deal, but the core components like ad specs are pretty standard. Keep in mind that the success of this template strategy relies on a super organized proposal content library. That'll make it easy for reps to find exactly what they need. Next is the template per offering approach. In this strategy, a template is created for each product or service that your company offers. The strategy is ideal for teams that sell more than one product or service, but still want to create detailed proposals fast. It's also great in industries like SaaS, where deals tend to be sold as bundles, packages, or in tiers. With multiple templates in use, the key here is ensuring that they all stay up to date. And remember, these are simply two of the most popular template stat strategies. You can always adapt a strategy to fit your team's unique needs if one of these doesn't seem to fit. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more tips from the proposal experts. And don't forget to click the notification bell so you never miss a video. See you next time.